Shalom, call Hala, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, that's giving all praise to the Most High. In the name of His only begotten Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. My name is Ibar from the Prophets in Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. And I only give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who taught us His truth and truth and sincerity. Peace and salutations to the hopeful like scattered abroad. This video is uh, titled Canel Joseph Meets a KKK Member. Canel Joseph meets a KKK member. And I want to highlight in this video how Esau has a perpetual hatred for you niggas, man. And Jake do these little, you know, videos trying to be funny and stuff. But all these Edomites got for you is hatred and buckshots, man. And one of these Edomites, I mean, one of these Jake's going to find themselves in a, you know, a horrific situation dealing with these Edomites, man. All right, because they ain't playing. Jake always playing. Jake, everything is a game. This is the Saudish people. But he's eating my same plan, man. So let's let this play. I just dropped off your sign, just to let you guys know. What sign's that? Did you guys not order it? Yeah, we didn't order it. Uh, no, we ain't ordering no shit like that. Oh. Uh, no, you can go ahead and get off this property, though. Oh, uh, my fault. You want it by chance or no? No, we don't want it. We're uh, uh, and they yeah. probably cut Sorry about that. That's a KKK member. Oh, shit. That's a KKK member. Bro, is he... Is he, what is he throwing up? Oh, that motherfucker's different. Right now, we're currently being followed. I don't know who it is, but we're being followed. If you wanna get the angle, that car's been like following us for a minute. So he's taking every single turn. He's following us right now. That shit is insane. Right. So you saw Jake. You know, I didn't blur his face I just out. dropped off your sign, just to let you guys know. You guys not order it? Yeah, Can you see what the sign oh, said? Ain't no shit like that. Let me go back to so Lockyer. Yeah. Dropped off your sign. Just let you guys know. What sign is that? Did you guys know? Damn, I'm trying to get that. Let me so lock you. Yeah. You guys know. What so there you go. All right, this Edom Mike got, got a damn knife in his damn belt buckle. All right, so this is Esau Edom. Okay, numero, in, I mean, numero uno enemy, enemy number, numero, I, I'm sorry, I don't know Spanish that great, I'm, I'm learning, I'm learning though, all right, but um, what you see right here is, you know, these red people, because they're not white, they're red, all right, and they have nothing but perpetual hatred for you Jakes, man, and Jake think everything is funny, but these you know, and he, you know, he's a KKK member. So what, what, what's happening is that's why he was showing us uh, tattoos and stuff. You know, what's happening is these these um, Edomites and KKK members, they're getting ready to, to, to make a move on you, Jake's man. But Jake think everything is a joke. think everything is a game. And it's our job to prophesy about this, because when this collapse comes, a lot of you Jake's are going to be, you know, destroyed by the hands of these people, man. And, and, and a lot of you Jake's going to destroy them, you know. But it's gonna be race wars and clashes out here, and, it's, and, and 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 we ain't seen nothing yet. So let's go to Ezekiel chapter thirty-five, verse one. It says, "Moreover, the word of the Lord Yahweh Bashim Shai came unto me, saying, Son of man, set thy face against Mount Seir and prophesy against it.' We're supposed to prophesy against these people. Okay, if every video video you 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 do is a disgruntled video about, you know, the the the, the former camp that you was in, or uh, the new covenant, you are not a prophet, you are not a man of the Lord, <laughs> you are not in the spirit, okay? The Lord told us to, to, to eat this whole roll and go and teach the children of thy people, okay? Not just a part of it, not just a part that you like, you know? So we got to go into all this. Let's go, it says, um, verse 3, and and say unto it, thus saith the Lord, Yahweh Bashim El Shai, behold, O Mount Seir, which is symbolic for, for these Edomites, the so-called white race, the Caucasians, I am against thee, the most high is against you. And I will stretch out mine hand against thee, and I will make thee most desolate. I will lay thy cities waste, and thou shalt be desolate, and thou shalt know that I am Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. So you're going to know who the true God of the Bible is very soon. And in their mindset, they think that they're God's chosen people and they're inferior because they have been lied to. Okay? Well, everybody's going to come to the understanding of who the true children of God is. All right. And this Jake, he knew what he was doing. You know, this Jake, he do a little, the little videos on YouTube, or whatever. He put that I love black people sign in they, in they are because he was trying to get a reaction. And he got one. They started following his ass. 
It says, and 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 we down here in the south, man. Down here in the south, we still got these uh these uh KKK cults, you know, run around and strong down here, man. You know, you go down the wrong, you know, uh 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 back road too late at night, you know, get a flat tire, your ass might might not make it out of there, man. You know, even I, me myself in particular, I remember, you know, I used to have to go down these back roads and, you know, to get home from work and stuff. And I and I made sure before I went down there, I had I had my, my tires filled up. I had gas in my car. You know, you didn't want to, you know, because it was it, it, it was a long road. You know, you didn't want to go to go down there and get end up getting stranded. And you think the person coming to come to help you is coming to help you. But they really come into, uh, you know. It says verse five, because thou has had a perpetual hatred. Now, perpetual means never ending. So from the beginning, they, they we we never got along. We never meant to get along, and we never gonna get along. Okay, they have that hatred for us, and these, you know, like you have Jakes that may appear to be Edomites, but 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 are Jakes. But then you have those red neck, you know, wasted away as he Edomites. Look how red his uh, hands is, man. Look at her, you know. It says because thou hast had a perpetual hatred and has shed the blood of the children of Israel by the force of the sword, in the time of their calamity. And the time that their iniquity had an end. So these Edomites, they, you know, when we, when, 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 when our hard bondage of slavery was lifted, they went harder. They started destroying, destroying jakes, man. Because they didn't kill you as openly when you was on a plantation. Because they, they, they bought for you and paid for you. They didn't need you to work. But when they so-called emancipated the slaves, hey, they started going around, uh, you know, killing jakes on, 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 on a whole different level, man. He started killing Jakes, man. All right, because their their fear was the Jakes coming back and killing them for for for, for what they did did unto them. It says, therefore, as I live, saith the Lord Yahweh Shimon Shai, I will prepare thee unto blood, and blood shall pursue thee. Saith thou hast not hated blood, even blood shall per, shall pursue thee. So you Edomites are going to have to, um, you know, take taste the blood that you had shed. All right. Thus will I make Mount Seir most desolate and cut off from it him that passeth out and him that returneth. And I will fill his mountains with his slain with, with, with his slain men and thy hills and thy valleys and in thy rivers. And it's like in all thy rivers shall they fall that are slain with the sword. Right. So that's what's coming. OK, you Edomites got hell to pay and the Lord has not forgotten about what you have, what you have done to the children of Israel. All right. Um, hmm. let me go here. Well, 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 let's grab this real quick because Jake is this whole little thing was stupid, man. This is Jer Jeremiah with the four verse twenty two. For my people is foolish; they have not known me, and you don't know who the Most High is. You don't know who you are. You don't know who your enemy is. They have none understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good they have no knowledge, and that's what Jake do. You know, dang, I hear serving the Lord. They serving themselves. They're trying to get followers and views. You know, and they end up finding themselves in t uh, terrible situations, man. Okay, so in, in, in horrific uh, 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 situations. Okay, like I said earlier, this man hated us from, from, from the beginning. Okay, his whole heart's desire was to, to destroy Jacob. And they're still doing that. They, they, they still feel like that. That's still their same spirit. Genesis chapter uh, 27, verse... Um, Let me go to verse 39. It says, And Isaac, his father, answered and said unto him, Behold, thy dwelling shall be the fatness of the earth and the dew of heaven from above. And by thy sword thou shalt live. So Esau's blessing was the sword, you know, weapons, violence. And this is, and this is how he's lived. This is how he's gotten everything that he has through violence. Okay. It says, And thou shalt serve thy brother. And it shall come to pass that when thou when thou has have shall have dominion, have the dominion, thou shalt break his yoke from all from off thy neck. And this is how they came back in power. It says, and Esau hated Jacob, because when the blessing wherewith his father blessed him, like if, for, because of the blessing wherewith his father blessed him, 
And Esau said in his heart, the days of mourning for my father are at hand. Then will I slay my brother Jacob. So this man's whole heart's desire is to kill you Israelites, man. And Jake want to play with fire, man. All right. You're going to find out. You're going to find out. And a lot of these Jakes are going to be given over to these Edomites, man. All right. So, like, I was just fine, but all of a sudden I'm doing a video and all of a sudden I'm yawning and stuff. Obadiah chapter 1, verse 8. Shall I not in that day, saith the Lord, Yehovah Bashim Shai, even destroy the wise men out of, e out of Edom and understanding out of the Mount of Esau? And I got a video on, um, I, just, I just passed by it on, I think it was Instagram, but it's on YouTube too, where you can find the most inbred family in America. And it's a bunch of Edomites that can't even talk, you know, all cockeyed and look like monsters because of what? Of inbreding, you know? cousin fucking all right it says and, and sister and brother okay it says thou shalt um flock you uh the pride of thine heart hath deceived thee unless thou was reading but they, they are proud let's go let's read that they're very proud obadiah chapter one verse three the pride of thine heart hath deceived thee, thou that dwellest in the cliffs of the rocks, whose habitation is high, that saith in his heart, who shall bring me down to the ground? Because Esau think that he not coming out of power. Though thou exalt thyself as the eagle, and though thou set thy nest among the stars, thence will I bring thee down to the ground. So you Edomites, your, your, your days are numbered. Verse 8, Shall I not in that day, saith Yahweh, by Shem Shai, even destroy the wise men out of Edom, and understanding out of the mount of Esau? And thy mighty men, O Teman, shall be dismayed to the end that every one of the Mount of Esau may be cut off by slaughter. So that's the final judgment and destination for you Edomites. Okay, you so-called Caucasians, you're going to be cut off by slaughter. It says, for, the, for thy violence against thy brother Jacob, shame shall cover thee and thou shall be cut off forever. So you, hey, the time is going to come when you're going to be cut off forever, man. Okay, that violence is going to catch up with you. Verse 15, for the day of Yahweh is near upon all the heathen. As thou hast done, it shall be done unto thee, and thy reward shall return upon thine own head. So what you've done to us is going to be done unto you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to close up with this right here. I'm going to make it too long. Well, maybe I got a few more, but let me grab this just in case. Uh, verse 17, but upon Mount Zion, which is the Israelites, shall, shall be deliverance. So the deliverance ain't coming for everybody. You want to be delivered from the missiles that's coming. The missiles are coming. And when they come, every last one of you Edomites are going to be heavy as hell on that day. Okay, you see seeing Jake's getting beamed up. It says, and there shall be holiness, and the house of Jacob shall possess their possessions. And the house of Jacob shall be a fire, and the house of Joseph a flame, and the house of Esau for stubble. And they shall kindle in them and devour them, and they shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau for Yahweh have spoken it. So that's going to be the final judgment of these Edomites, man. Okay? The final judgment of Esau, Edom. Which is going to be um, extermination. Okay? Because they sought to exterminate us. Revelation. Revelation chapter 13, verse 9. If any man have an ear, let him hear. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. And he that cliff with the sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the patience of all the faith. Here is the patience and all and the faith of the saints. Right. So the saints are the Israelites. Let's grab that. We'll close out with that. We'll close out with that, man. All right. That's what a song. Oh, when the saints go marching in. Oh, when the saints go marching in, which are the Israelites. And that's when um, the saints go, mar go, go marching into what? P uh, the kingdom, paradise. Okay, salvation. <laughs> and that's not going to be for everybody. So like, yeah. Scripture says the saints of the Most High shall take the kingdom. All right, so we're not going to ask for it. We're not going to uh, delegate for it. No, we're going to take it, okay, through violence. And every kingdom 
Every time there's a transition of power or a rulership, it's always through violence. All right. It's never a time where there's a peaceful transition. Like you have these um, here in America, they, they, they be voting and stuff, which really, you know, um, which really, uh, you know, that voting stuff, you know, all of them presidents are related, man. OK, and, and they all fall following the same protocol from the powers that be the, the ruling elite, which are Edomites. So it's never a change of power. OK, it's the same birds. It's, 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 it's two different wings on the same bird. OK, when they both and they all going in the same direction. But right now, this bird is falling to the ground. OK. Let me see if I can find the scripture. So like here. Uh. It says, um, Psalms chapter 148, verse 13, let them praise the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai and his name alone is excellent. Uh, his glory is above the earth and heaven. He also. So like him, he also exalteth the horn of his people, which horn is symbolic for power. The praise of all his saints, even the children of it's like even of the children of Israel, a people near unto him, praise ye Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Right? So it's all about the, the children of Israel, which are the Israelites. So these Edomites, they're upset. They know that their 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 time their time to rule is over. Let me grab I'll close out with that. So like I'm not keep something close out, but Amen. You know. If the spirit going, then we going. Let me grab this though. Um, Cause Esau's time to rule is coming to an end. I guess Dwayne Johnson's father died. It says Job chapter 14, verse 5. Seeing his days are determined, the number of his months are with thee. Thou hast appointed his bounds that he cannot pass. So this man can only go so far. Who can bring a clean thing out of an unclean? Not one. So they ain't right. And they ain't going to get right. So they're going to have to get destroyed. Okay. And that's what's coming. All right. But as of right now, Esau is still in his kingdom. And you got to be weary of these devils. You know, don't be trying to play games, thinking everything funny. Everything is a joke because it's not. All right. I just dropped off your sign, just to let you guys know. What sign's that? Did you guys not order it? Yeah, we didn't order it. Uh, no, we ain't order no shit like that. Oh. Uh, no, you can go ahead and get off this property, though. Oh, my fault. Do you want it by chance, or no? No, we don't want it. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> Look at that. I forgot what the AC stand for. All crackers. <laughs> oh shit, that's a KKK member, bro. Look at this dude's haircut, man. He's throwing up signs of shit. He throw, you know, he. Look at his face. Oh, is he? Is he? What is he throwing up? Oh, that motherfucker's different. Right now, we're currently being followed. I don't know who it is, but we're being followed. If you want to get the angle, that car has been like following us for a minute. So he's taking every single turn. He's following us right now. That shit is insane. Wow. So there you go. Show I just dropped up the sign just to let you guys know.